much better as allies. Off we go. Trochadi. Alexios. Darius. I heard you coming, you know. Wasn't trying to sneak. Mm-hmm. It's good to see you. They've missed you? You know there is nowhere else I'd rather be. Adventure calls to people like us. For so long, my purpose was Persia. She was all I could see. But a parent's duty is not to their ambition. It's to their family, Alexios. <sighs> How's my boy? Oh, he's in terrible danger, Alexios. Elpidios is missing. What? <laughs> oh, <laughs> they're playing hide and seek. Again? You know, it was Nima's favorite game, too, when she was Elpidios' age. How are they? We've been getting used to being in one place. It's harder than you think. Heard anything about the Order? Nothing, no news. After the Tempest, they've gone quiet. They're never quiet. Is Elpidios at the usual spot? <laughs> he loves that beach. Make sure you find the boy. I always do. After you, Darius. Come, the beach is this way. You're still quite fast, Darius. Maybe you're just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Walls of flame. Skies black with arrows. And more beasts and blades than Heracles himself. But none match parenthood. It's a different one. You'll do fine, Alexis. You are really Could help. 
Elpidios B. Elpidios! Who is that? Butter's coming to find you. Elpidios loves splashing around in the water jars. I wonder. Is my little warrior here? Hmm, guess not. A tent. We used to sleep in one and watch the stars together. That's where he must be. Oh no. Elpidios sure is great at hiding. This shipwreck looks like it can hide Elpidios and his matter. Let me take a look. Aha! Found you! Wow! Isn't Pater a mighty Mystheos? He will surely tell tales of this epic adventure for years to come. Don't forget to pay the Mystheos for his heroic services. Ah, my usual great. Welcome home. I've missed you, my love. Both of you. How's our littlest warrior? Been on more of your famous adventures, no doubt? <gasps> A cyclops! Oh, my! Oh, you slew how many Athenians? Impressive. You're putting Brasidas' his record to shame. <laughs> oh, stop. How've you been? Safe. Feeling safe. Relaxed. Except our little warrior's appetite keeps growing. <laughs> Greedy boy. Darius sent me a note. Something about a celebration? We figured it was time for a little family gathering. And it's not a family gathering without a great feast. Elpidius and I will prepare the boar, won't we? <laughs> boar? That takes me back. Alexios and I will go look for some shellfish. We'll have the fire ready by the cliff. See you later, little warrior. Come, Alexios. It's been a while since we had some time to ourselves. Darius seems happier with their videos around. <laughs> Grandchildren have a mysterious effect on people. But I'm surprised you can tell behind all that thing. Let's go. What do you think Elpidios will be when he grows up? You mean, will he join the family business and spend his days mystiosing across the Greek world? It's not a bad life. I've got a boat. A ship, even. <laughs> He'll be whatever he wants. He'll be me. He'll be our son. This is a nice, quiet spot. <laughs> The pools are the perfect size for amphibians. Been a while since I had shellfish. Spending time with you like this is... I like this. So... Do you think Elpidios looks more like me? You're probably right. These should do for our feast. You might have left some for everyone else. <laughs> Let's head back to the cliff before Father returns. There's something I wanted to show you. The cliff is this way. With Elpidios around, it's hard to get time together. He's a very demanding little boy. He gets that from his partner.
This view is just... Breathtaking. You said you had something to show me? <laughs> Maybe. Don't keep me waiting. We need to be quick about this. I haven't lost my touch, have I? It was great, but this isn't why I brought you here. Ah. I brought you here to show you this. This looks like a charm of some sort. My mother gave it to me when I was a child. This will keep you safe. May it see you through any storm. You're safe because you're strong. Your mother would be proud of who you become. But now? I don't need it anymore. Dima! I can't promise I'll always be here, but I'll do my best. And I'll do mine. Here he comes! Here comes my big man! Elpidios is hungry. Well, he's had a big day out with his grandpa Tordarius. Elpidios can stay up a little later. He needs his rest. He's had too much fun today. I should come with you. We'll be fine. Say bye-bye, Elpidios. <laughs> Close enough. <laughs> <laughs> the excitement of living on the road or do you enjoy the quiet life it's too quiet <laughs> uh -huh. I'm used to the growls of stalking wolves blades being unsheathed in the darkness Dima is just too quiet enjoying being a grand potter children are wonderful but to love so deeply is terrifying don't spoil him too much. Too late. This is it, Darius. A simple life. for a ride. Don't worry. I'm coming. Potter's coming. Dima. Elpidios. Hold on. Elpidios! Elpidios! What? Does anyone see? 
hear my son? Artabanus, Alexios, welcome home. Morondas, you were with the Order? He is the Order, Amorgus. I trusted you, helped you. My friend, it's been far too long. We were protectors, Amorgus, champions of the people. This is wrong. This is necessary. I take no pleasure in this. I needed to draw you in. It's you I want, Alexios. You and your bloodline. Don't you dare touch her! Alexios, go! You Get the fuck off my way! Bring me on home! Not today, but you will! Stop it, you're so Go! Get Elpidios out of here! We leave together! No! I will make sure the Order can't catch up to you! There's too many! You don't have to do this! We have no time to argue! Go! Think about the child! I love you, Nima! Father! Come back to me! Keep them safe! Promise me. I promise. No one! 
comes at my family! No one leaves! No one lives! Pidios, hold on. Get on the boat, quickly. Father, come back to us. Ah! <laughs> 
Amorgus. Did you see him? No! Oh. The beach. You promised to protect them. You promised to keep them safe. I should have stayed behind. I should have been with them. I... It's my fault. I did this. We're supposed to pay for our pasts, for our mistakes, not our children. There's no sign of Elpidios, but he's still alive, Darius. I know it. If the Order have him, we can find him. You've lost people you loved before. How... How did you survive? Who said I survived? Wonderful, painful, beautiful moment for every moment spent with you. I love you, Nima. I'll find our boy. I'll bring him home. Trust me. Alexios. By the gods. Oh, I am sorry. The Order did all this. This weaponry they brought would make even Ares turn his head. 
There's only one place in the Greek world that makes anything like it. Messenia. They came for us. For me. If the Order is in Messenia, that's where I'll go. Imaginations, right? <laughs> this looks familiar. <laughs> Calm down, it, it wasn't real. It was Malaka. So it, it was a moving shadow. These kills him. were clean. The guards came here and went inside. He stayed to stand watch, and then he just fell over. And there was blood everywhere. It was a blur. A blur, Didi. I saw it. Someone's on the rampage. Darius! Eagle bearer. Never thought I'd find you here. Count yourself lucky I didn't mistake you for one of them. What are you doing in Messenia? If Elpidios is alive, he's with Amorgus. And Messenia is Amorgus' stronghold. Looks like you figured that much out on your own. But it'll be hard to find him. He's too well insulated. There must be a way to flush him out. I have some ideas. Amorgus has the entire Spartan army at his back, led by some of his most trusted commanders. It will be tough to get to him unless we weaken his forces. We can do that. The Order has a large production line for their weapons. There is a commander behind it all. Start by speaking to the Ilotes. They might know where he is. Also, the Cult of Cosmos is reinforcing the Order in Messenia, and an Order commander, Democratis, is in charge of seeing that through. If we cut him down, the Cult will no longer be in our way. I'm 
good at calling the cult. Uh, there's one more thing. I've heard that the Order has captured an Athenian general. He is integral to my plans. You will need to free him and give him this letter. And then I get Elpidios. Tell me more about Democrates. Amorgis put him in charge of the Order's dealings with the cult. He's well known, but he seldom makes public appearances. This is a rare opportunity to get to him. This Athenian general, what do you want with him? If we free him, we will have a powerful ally. Where can I find the Ilotes for information on the commander? In Epia. That's where all the weapon manufacturing happens. I'll get it done. We'll strike them hard and fast. We? Oui. It will be faster and more efficient if there's two of us. Getting Elpidios back is my top priority. I'll tolerate you until then. Good. The feeling is mutual. I've wasted enough time here. Come back when you finish disrupting the order. There's more to be done. I see him. There he is. Let's hope no one notices me here. Huh? There's definitely something there. Hmm. I'm just scared. Yeah!
You saved me! Thank you, Mistyos! Have you seen the Ilot named Drodi? Yes, she was taken to the center of Epir! I heard she's going to meet her end there! Can you tell me where the Ilot Rodi is? Who's that? I'm free now, I don't care! The town center. I should hurry. your mouth. Oh. That's what you get for taking what isn't yours. Your death shall be a warning to them all. I don't care who the food belongs to. We were hungry. If you're here for the show, I think you'll have a clearer view from down there with the rest. Who are you? I'm here for this woman. Ah, she got caught stealing from the kitchens again. We're under strict instructions from the Commander to ensure that stops today. I need her alive. Release her, and no one gets hurt. There's a price for everything, Mistyos. We'll need Drachmi to replenish our food supplies. I'll pay for her. <laughs> well then, it seems that I forgot about the extra cost for our troubles. Torture is hard work, you know. Double it, and I'll give her to you. Hades, don't give him a single drachma. Shut up. <sighs> Enough. I'm taking her, along with your heads. Yeah, get him. You picked the wrong side. Get the Mystios. You're gonna get what you pay for. <laughs> Should have cut out. What are you doing here? You said I could leave if I wanted to. I'll have to. That was close. Thanks, Miss Theos. Good thing you came along. Bye. Wait. I'm looking for the commander. I was told you know something about him. The commander? Oh, I know him all right. <laughs> Brings back fond memories. I used to work for that Malakas. 
This commander sounds terrible. He's ruthless, Mistyos. He would work us till our hands were red and raw, and we'd bleed and cry until dawn. Even the children weren't spared. Which is why I have to pinch food when I can. It's never enough. You were lucky I arrived just in time. How did you get caught? They caught me stealing one loaf of bread and sentenced me to death. So what if I stole from them ten other times? It's too much! Too severe! Point me to the commander, and I'll stick my blade through his throat. You're looking to kill him? Mm-hmm. Great. Things are happening in Messinia, Mistyos. Look at how we're suffering, how the children suffer. There must be something better out there for them. I have a plan to get the children away from here. My son and the others. Help the children and I'll help you. I'll do it. But you better tell me where the commander is. So kind of you, Mistyos. I promise you'll find your target. Just don't gut him in front of the children. What's your plan to get the children out? We have a fisherman nearby who is being paid handsomely for the job. We need to take the children to his boat near the docks, but we need to leave soon. Time is almost up. Lead the way. Follow me. Mistyos' friend. He's going to help us get out of here. All right, everyone. Matter says to follow the Mistyos. Stay in the group so we don't get lost. Stay in the group so we don't get lost. This is serious. Do you have a hero name, Mistyos? A hero name is a cold name only the greatest, bestest heroes. It is usually a combination of a cool and a
let's not try to start a revolt while we're here. Hey, Koros. <laughs> Why don't you choose one for me? It's time for you to go, little pebble. You're not coming? I can't. I have to stay here and work hard so I can visit you one day. No, no! Where's my mother? Where's my mother? <laughs> I can't be without you, mother. Who will hug me when I have a bad dream? Mistyos, I, I'm not sure. Now that we're here, I don't know if I can bear to send them away. <laughs> don't make us go, please! You have to go. Messenia is crawling with danger. It's not safe for children. But what about our parents? What will happen to them? They want what's best for you. Now go. The boat is waiting. Kere, my pebble. Things will be better for them out there. You're right. If the children stayed, I don't know if we'd be able to protect them. I hope they have a better life ahead. Better than we could have given them. We will always fight for our children. Always. And you got your commander. Thank you, Mistyos. May our paths cross again.
That must be the Athenian Darius was talking about. This won't take much. What do I call you? Most people call me Eagle Bearer. The what? You heard me. It just... I've heard the stories we all have, but I never thought... I don't have time for stories. Right, right. It's these Malacca Spartans. We desperately need to loosen their grip on this region. Will you help us? At the moment, I'm not a big fan of the Spartans. Or their friends. The Persians. You know? I know those Kert Spartans are richer than I've ever been, and should have run out of resources years ago. I was told to give you this. Uh huh. It seems we have common enemies. I can help you and your allies with your plan, but to do it, we must kill the Spartan leader here in Messenia. What's so special about this particular Spartan? He is a butcher. He's killed more Athenians than anyone, and he takes joy in it, I tell you. We know his location, but my men and I haven't been able to get close to him. You'll find it easier with me around. There. That's his fleet. Oh, his fleet, you say? If I get overturned out here, I don't think I can swim back.
Lower the oars! Spot. I'm gone. Morgus is due to mess in the weekend.
Close up now! Head for open water! You're released until the commander's return. That Spartan dog is just a memory now. You did it? Thanks for sharing. Not like there's much to spend it on here anyway. The Spartan butcher was no match for me. Of course. So, about the letter you gave me? I'll need you to live up to your end of the bargain if you want the Persians out of Messenia. Uh, you can count on our help when you are ready. Thank you. Darius? We meet again, Eagle Bearer. Good, you're back. Now to set our plan in motion. We will set several fires. The smoke will force the Ilotes to flee and draw Amorgus's guards down from the mine. Striking at the heart of the enemy while minimizing the cost of innocent lives. 
A wise plan. I will see to it that my men light up the rest of the area. What happened? Nima died protecting Elpidios. Someone from the Order wanted to meet with me. He was there, Darius. They found Nima in the shipwreck. She tried to fight them all. This was Nima's. I haven't had a chance to. I forgot I even took it. She's gone. She's really gone. And she's never coming back. I'll never forget her, Darius. I miss her. Even now. I miss her so much. We'll have time to grieve when this is over. Right now, we know Elpidios is alive. It's time to get him back. If Amorgus is here, Elpidios must be as well. Once we start, we can't go back. They will come at us with all they've got. It's time to attack. The price may be... everything. I know the price. Time to find the boy. It is. Yeah! 
Where is Amorgis? The mines! But you'll never get around his defenses! I'll crush his defenses, and then I'll kill him! You're insane! Both of you! You're going to tell Amorgis that the Eagle Bearer, the great disruption of the Greek world, is here at his door! You tell him I'm coming for him! For Elpidios! And I don't knock! Go! I'll take care of the order guards. Need to get to the mines. <coughs> I'll take out as many as I can on the way. I should try. <laughs> Somewhere. You can't hide from me, Amorgis! It's too quiet. Hiding a Morgus. Come get what you deserve. Look, the Eagle Bearer. Alexios. Where is Morgus? He's in the temple above the mine. But that time will come. He's just like Yeris described in his entries. Fierce. Oh, Yeris. He was the best of us. You were his favorite character, Eagle Bearer. And yet, you murdered him. Yeris was part of the Order. All of you deserve what's coming. We have no intention of walking away. I'll get to my son. Ha <laughs> ha! Elpidios. He still has his littlest warrior in his heart. He still has. What a foolish thing to hold on to. <laughs> <laughs> we, we will fight for Persia until our dying breath. The lives, the raised cities. It is for Amorgia's vision of peace, his grand design. All things are permitted. <laughs> Morgus is in the temple. 
I'm coming, Antidios. I'll find you. Morgas, today you bleed. I should try to stay out of sight. Dios, I'm almost there. My son, Pater's coming. Calm, aren't they? Moments like these. The moments before the end. If you've hurt my son, nothing will protect you. No man, no beast, no god. He's safe with me, Alexios. Happy, healthy. And I promise you, he always will be. Where is Elpidios? Where is my son? Far from war. Far from danger. Far from you. I once swore to the people I loved that I would crush the Order. Believe me, I will keep that promise. You think you can destroy us? <laughs> the Order's plan goes well beyond you, Alexios. What? Ever the hero. Thinking this is all about you. This isn't about any one of us. It's about that most precious of things, peace. This war between Athens and Sparta threatens to incinerate more than just the Greek world. The carnage and butchery have spread to Persia and beyond. The Order has the power to save the world. And so we will. My agents are rooted deeply in every aspect of Greek life. We have seeped into your establishments, your temples, your homes. We are winning the hearts of your people. Through the Order's influence and Persia's wealth, Sparta will end this war. A new chapter in history will be written... by us. We have planted a seed in the fertile soil that is the Greek people. And now, peace will grow. Only one threat to that peace remains. You. You want a war, you monster? 
I'll give you a war. You already have. You're a tainted one. The strongest, most dangerous force the Order has ever seen. You are fire. Only you stand in the way of the Order's purpose. You've forgotten our promise, old friend. Artabanus. I wondered when you'd make your dramatic entrance. Think of the innocent lives that were lost, Amorgus. You claim to want peace, but what good is peace when it's enforced by tyranny? I fought for the greater good, for our children, for their futures. I saved your grandson, and I saved Artaxerxes that night. Do you remember? I saved him from you. Tell us where Elpidios is. I'm sorry. As long as I breathe, I will never endanger the child by letting him raise him. Where is Alpidius? Tell me! Tell me! You cannot raise the boy! With you, he'll never be saved! He's my son! Remind me, old friend. Of all the old power, they could not protect you. Not from me. We must protect the people we love, Amorgus. That's what I'm doing. Where is the child? It's safer hands than yours, Darius. Sun rises, but she also sets. My time is over, old friend. We were protectors, Amorgus. We were champions of Persia, of the people. I still am our Hobanos. I only wanted to keep our home safe, the world safe.
the child of Orgus. Please. He's on a small island just off the coast of Messenia. Perfect spot for fishing. The Order will never give up, Alexios. You and your boy will always be hunted. I know. The Order aren't just a group of people. They're an idea. An idea cannot be beaten. An idea cannot be destroyed. Not by blades, but through knowledge, through wisdom, through ideas of our own. Nothing is absolute, Amorgus. You taught me that a long time ago. There will always be tyrants. And there will always be you, my brother, to stop them. Go in peace, old friend. This was true to his word. Elpidios will be there. Water's coming. Water's pretty deep here. I should turn back. Just a moment more, Elpidios. Hold on. Just hold on. <laughs> my boy. My son. My beautiful son. Elpidios. <laughs> Butter's here. You've kept watch over my son? Every day, every night, Amorgis made sure of it. Thank you. You know, he has a real Spartan appetite. <laughs> Tell me about it. Butter's got so many stories to tell you. <laughs> and you've got some stories for Butter too, I see. Who are you? I am Darius. Son of the Persian king, Artaxerxes. Artaxerxes. You know my father. We've met, but 
It's been a while. He's a good king and a great father. Persia knows peace. She prospers. I miss him. Keep Persia safe. That is his legacy. It's time. Just a moment longer. It has to be now. What will you do? Morges was right. I am fire. I'll use that. A beacon to the Order. If they want to come after my bloodline, they'll know exactly where to find me. But they'll never find... And, uh, what will you do, Darius? The Order was created for a purpose. If I can understand our enemy, I can outmaneuver them. I will protect the boy, Alexios. Be a guardian to Elpidios and to all those who share his blood. When the day comes, when he asks of his pater, <sighs> what should I tell him? Tell him he had a pater, and a mother who lived incredible lives, who saw incredible things, and none of it was as incredible as him. His smile, his laugh, <laughs> the sight of him asleep in my arms. <laughs> Should a day come, where he feels unloved or alone, you tell him there is no such day because he will always be loved. You hear me? You will always be loved. You'll fight, and you'll fall. There will be times when you'll think you can't rise again. You'll want to stay down, but you will get up, Elpidios. Because you're strong. Because our bloodline is strong. And because we always get up. You'll ask why. And while you'll never know me, know this. You are my son, and I will always fight for you. You, and those that will come after. The Morgus is dealt with, and I have his blade. It's useless, broken, and the metal is strange. I should find a blacksmith. Our 
baby safe. Your father, too. It's only you I could... I never got the chance to say goodbye. There are some things I want to get for you. This time, I'll be back. <laughs>